This idea came by looking at um, various opportunities and needs as I, while I grew up in Nigeria. Most of the um, free time when I was away from school, I went to the villages where I saw kids, and including myself, we had to go, you know, to a local watering hole to get water. Women have to um, spend most of their day just collecting water because um, the sources are very far away, especially in dry regions. Um, and this really deters from the amount of time they can spend um, with the family, um, getting an education, or cultivating a small business. We brained someone an idea of uh, using a backpack scenario and having people carry the water on their backs. Well, are you sure that would really um, meet the need? Do people in the, those regions feel comfortable just putting a backpack on? Will that carry enough water? One of the original ideas was we need to get as much water as possible into these devices. You know, that the key issue that we were solving was the fact that women in rural areas were making multiple trips to the watering hole. If we can provide them the opportunity to make less trips, that they would be more efficient and therefore this would be a breakthrough product. I really wanted to come up with something that would um, have the appropriate um, weight and shape so that if um, some, if a woman was carrying a child with her or if she um, was not particularly able to, you know, like lower a heavy device to fetch water, like this would be, still be something that would be easy for her to do. Whatever we came up with, we tested it. So if you came up with an idea and you felt passionate about it, you'd have to prove it to the team that this was actually something that was worthwhile. And it wasn't until we started having the females on our team holding up 35 pounds and trying to tip it over as they would uh, you know, when they were using this product that that really kind of came through for us. So our idea is for um, a series of units that would fit together and roll along um, the road on the axle. And the women would be able to separate the individual units and collect them at um, a dugout or spring. We have a pin concept um, on either side of them so that all the units are, can remain in place when they're being rolled. And the axle is long enough so that um, people can transport between four and, um, and six units. So we can get it up to be about um, 90 liters of water. It comes with two caps, um, and so pe when people are filling it at the source, they can unscrew the cap. Um, dunk it into the water source, which would usually be a dugout or a spring from some of our from the research we did. Um, and then after they finished filling it, they put the cap back on. The next step for Aquaport is we are taking the product on the ground in Ghana to test it in the actual terrain, test with the actual users to get some actual real valuable feedback. Um, this is, I think, the most essential part of what we're doing is to make an impact and really sitting down and talking to people on the ground in the continent. All inventors need an aspect of teamwork or need some skill set around teamwork because even though invention can be a sole person's idea, there are a number of stakeholders that are necessary to bring along through that process. Having a diverse team of individuals that can really look at a problem or look at a solution from multiple different viewpoints has, was very effective for us. Having members of a team that had manufacturing backgrounds that could really argue what material or what material wouldn't work, how it was difficult to manufacture the device or how easy it was. Anyone out there who is a young person looking to invent, it's a, it's a lot of failures, it's a lot of trial by, and error. Um, but it's a very rewarding process, I think, when you're able to say that you took something that didn't exist before and made something, you know, made something new, made something different, even if it's an improvement on what was out there before. It's, it's definitely something that um, women should consider more. Um, and I, I think that it really gives you a lot, of, a lot of credibility when you're dealing with, you know, large group projects in which you're working on product design. Aquaport has the opportunity to transform lives, to allow both the women and children to have more time to do various activities. Children will have a lot more time instead of going to the water source to fetch water. They can actually focus on other skills, whether it's you know, schoolwork or arts and crafts. Women will not be limited to the act of just caring for, transporting water. They can actually do, learn other skills, um, spend more time with their families, um, take on jobs, take on other roles, and really push 
allow more time to be, do more creative and more impactful things with your lives. My name is Mary and I'm an inventor. My name is Ash and I'm an inventor. My name is Dapo and I'm an inventor.